Hello, I'm Chris Wills, Director of Training at RDI Technologies, and I'd like to welcome you to another installment of Tips and Tricks. The motion map feature in motion amplification can greatly simplify the analysis process, especially when there are many different potential sources of motion in a single recording. However, the process of running the motion map greatly increases the amount of data associated with the RDI file. For example, the typical three second acquisition taken at 120 frames per second generally takes about one gigabyte of data storage space. But after the motion map has been generated, that one gigabyte of data balloons to over 2.9 gigabytes, which uses a lot more of your computer's hard drive storage space. With the release of software version 3.3, RDI Technologies has provided a simple solution to this problem. In Motion Explorer, highlight the recording that contains the motion map data. When I launch MA and click the motion map button, the motion map information pops up instantly. So you can see that the motion map information has already been saved to this recording. So in Motion Explorer, I highlight the recording, which identifies the file size as 2.9 gigabytes and I click the Compact Recording button. And just like that, the file size has been decreased to 1.1 gigabytes because the motion map data has been erased. This is Chris Wills reminding you to visit us online at www.rditechnologies.com for the latest motion amplification tips and tricks.